Hey folks, hope everyone is doing well. Happy 2023. I want to share with you a new sword project I've been working on. So here's uh, some copper sword parts that I've got and I thought I would try to put a patina on them. I actually like this look of the bare copper but I just kind of wanted to uh, give it a, a try at this project. I've never done this before and here's how they worked out. This is after my second attempt. I learned a couple things along the way which I want to share with you guys but there it is on the sword. It looks kind of orange in certain lights but it also looks kind of red in other lights. Uh, there it is in comparison with uh, standard white brass hibaki on a different sword. And here's the process. I just take some peanut oil. This is from my peanut butter. I get the natural stuff, so it's got a layer of oil on top. And I got a little sponge. And then I kind of apply it to the parts. And this is one thing I've learned is that uh, at first I put too much oil and used too much heat and kind of got certain splotchy parts and whatever. But there it is in comparison to uh, a hibaki, sorry, a seppa that hasn't been done. And it definitely has some character. The Haman on this is kind of fiery, so I thought that if I could match that theme, it would actually go pretty well. And here you can see it looks a little different depending on the angle and the lighting. Don't know if I like it as much or less or whatever, but anyway, here's some things that I learned. One is that the parts have to be really clean. I like to scrub them with soap and water on sandpaper. Second part is that the sandpaper polish has to be very consistent, otherwise it's going to show up in the patina after. The third is to use minimum oil. And the fourth is to use minimum heat, where like the edges of my sepa look a little bit more silvery because they got too much heat. But this is a pretty cool project. There's some samagawa that I'm throwing onto it. And I kind of like that. It's going to look pretty good when it's done. So there it is. It's got some pretty good glow to it. And uh, I think it gives it some finished character. Thanks for watching and have a good day.